I've saved the exercise files on my desktop. So I'm going to click on desktop here and there's my folder. You see that I've taken three pictures in Snow Canyon State Park. I pointed my camera at this and snapped a shot, then turned about 20 degrees or so, snapped another shot, turned another 20 degrees and snapped a third shot. These would make a great panorama. So I'm going to hold my shift key down and select all three of these and then open them in Camera Raw. Now, if I select all three in Camera Raw, you'll notice that as I hover over any of these images, I have some buttons that I can press. I'm going to do this menu and I'm going to choose Merge to Panorama. And it'll give me a preview right here. In the preview, I have several projections I can use. If you watch the image, you'll see it change slightly with each projection. Choose the one that looks the best to you. You have a boundary warp slider, which lets you adjust the image just a little bit. You can fill the edges if you wish. What that does, let me turn that off. If auto crop is turned on, it will compensate for any shake that you did moving the camera uh, and it'll crop in and so you don't have any blank areas. If you fill the edges, then Photoshop will use content aware fill to do that. And so I'm going to click on merge now. What will happen is all three of those JPEGs will be merged into one camera raw file with the data from all three images in there. And I'll just click on save. And there we go. And so I can work from here to adjust it. I'm looking at the histogram. The, the shadows are a little low so i'm going to bring those up a little bit i'm watching the clipping warnings so i don't want really to lose any data here in the basic panel i think i will add a little dehaze which will bring that down just a, a touch a little clarity gives you a little bit more contrast there you could add a little more texture. Bring the back blacks up just a touch more. And then I'll click open. And there I have it. It's going to open up in Photoshop now, where I can continue working on it.